G'day guys, how we going? If you're anything like me, pretty pissed off at seeing this screen. So, I know how to fix it, and I will share it with you. The easiest way that I know of fixing it is to go to my computer, whether you can have it on the desktop there, or you can find it through your start menu on the little grey part there. Okay, on the far side you'll have libraries. If you don't have that part there, I don't know what you've done to your windows. Um, but you want to find my documents, or documents library, basically. And it will have a folder in it called Rockstar Games. Inside that folder you will have GTA 5 and Social Club. Now, under Social Club there is a Profiles folder there. I've deleted that and it didn't work. And I found the easiest way to fix it is to go into the Profiles thing and delete the Profiles file that's in there. And then start the game up with nothing in there. You know, have an empty folder, it'll download the stuff back from the net and refill your Profiles thing. Now, in doing that, it will make you do the prologue again. You will have to do the prologue again. Um, so what I did, or what I'm about to do anyway, is now that I have uh, finished the game, uh, not finished the game, finished the prologue and managed to log out successfully, I'm going to copy this profiles folder and I'm going to make a new folder called new folder because I don't really care and I'm going to paste my profiles folder into there. So if it ever stuffs up again, I will be able to go to a clean start from after the prologue, I assume. I assume. But at least you don't have to look at this picture anymore because, hey, doing a five minute prologue to get back into online, eh, you can do that. <laughs> I, I did it, you can too. So hopefully this fixes your problem. If not, well, hopefully support answers you, because they didn't answer.